flashes on the side of the freeway is something we've all become used to in Phoenix. But one proposed bill is hoping to put an end to those photo radar cameras. Reporter Liz Lastra is live in Phoenix with the story. Liz? Thanks, Kim. You may have gotten the ticket in the mail with your face smiling back at you. But one, and there were more than 78 cameras currently running around Arizona. One lawmaker is looking to make those lights a little dimmer. The flash of the camera goes off. And with one photo, you just got a ticket. That's exactly what happened with Stephanie Martin when she got her first photo radar ticket in the mail. Are you serious? I can't believe it. Everyone gets these. I've been doing so good. But she was anything but good when she decided not to pay the ticket and got an unexpected visitor. I answered the door and he asked if I was Stephanie Martin. She was being summoned to court for not paying up, and she's not alone. According to DPS, more than 2 million photo radar tickets have been given out since the cameras were installed in 2008. But one bill is hoping to make photo radar a thing of the past. Representative Lucy Mason is primary sponsor of House Bill 2085. The proposed bill would make getting a ticket something only an officer can hand out, not a camera. A camera simply cannot do this. So the only thing that they can do is look it up at a speeding violation. But DPS spokesperson Bart Graves says these cameras have saved lives and slowed people down. It is working. We believe it's done what it set out to do, and we hope uh, we hope it continues. While safety is a concern, Representative Mason believes photo radar is a violation of our constitutional rights. You need to be able to face your accuser. And Martin agrees. I'd much rather have a ticket handed to me and have an officer say, I saw you speeding. But until House Bill 2085 is signed into law, those cameras on the roadways will keep on flashing. Now, the cameras were expected to bring in close to $90 million, but so far have only brought in close to a third of that. So far, the proposed bill has already passed to a first and second hearing, set to hit the legislative floor next. Live in Phoenix, Liz Lostra, Cronkite News.